Good morning, and welcome to Learning to Praise in the Psalms, a daily devotional um, by David Hawking. So today I'm reading from Psalm 30, verses 1 through 6, and maybe I'll go to the end. So this is the blessed, the blessedness of answered prayer, a psalm, a song at the dedication of the house of David. Verse 1 from the New King James. I will extol you, O Lord, for you have lifted me up and have not let my foes rejoice over me. O Lord, my God, I cried out to you, and you healed me. O Lord, you brought my soul up from the grave. You have kept me alive that I should not go down to the pit. Sing praise to the Lord, you saints of his, and give thanks at the remembrance of his holy name. For his anger is but for a moment. His favor is for life. Weeping may endure for a night, but joy comes in the morning. Now in my prosperity, I said, I shall never be moved. And um, tomorrow's reading, I'll just go ahead and finish Psalm 30, verses 7 through 12, which are right over here. Lord, by your favor, you have made my mountain stand strong. You hid your face, and I was troubled. I cried out to you, O Lord, and to the Lord I made supplication. What profit is there in my blood when I go down to the pit? Will a dust praise you? Will it declare your truth? Hear, O Lord, and have mercy on me. Lord, be my helper. You have turned for me my mourning into dancing. You have put off my sackcloth and clothed me with gladness to the end of that my glory may sing praise to you and not be silent. O Lord my God, I will give thanks to you forever. So, um, so yes, so we declare the glory and praise to the Lord God Almighty, um, and we declare the, the faithfulness of God. God is a faithful God. So wherever you're at today, whether you're in mourning, know that he is going to turn your mourning into dancing. Um, if you're in ashes and sackcloth, he's going to change that into gladness because he is a faithful God um, and he's a good father. He's a holy God. He's a holy father and um, and he loves us. He loves you. He loves me. You know, John three sixteen. for God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son that whosoever would believe in him or would not perish, but would have eternal life. So we have been given the opportunity and the gift of eternal life through Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. So, um, so cry out to the Lord, cry out to Him with a, a pure and sincere heart. Um, whatever is on your heart, the Lord can handle it, um, and He hears you, and He wants to hear your voice, and your prayer, and your heart, and He wants our eyes to turn to him psalm 121 1 and 2 i lift my eyes up to the mountains where does my help come from my help comes from the lord the maker of heaven and earth you can look that up um, later if you want well we can go there right now let's just go there right now real quick okay psalm 121 where is it 122 119 121 God, the help of those who seek him. I will lift my eyes up to the hills from whence comes my help. My help comes from the Lord who made heaven and earth. So just know, my friend, my lis the listener, um, God wants to help us. God wants to help you. And all he asks is that we turn our heart and our eyes towards him today. So yes, dear Lord, we turn our hearts um, to you again afresh and new this day whether it's morning afternoon or evening whenever the listener is hearing my voice for me right now it's um morning time here in southern california and father i i lift my eyes up to you right now and i turn my heart towards you and towards heaven and lord i say how grateful and thankful i am for your goodness for your mercy for your kindness um, for Jesus Christ, I am so thankful for the blood that was shed on the cross for me and for all of my sin. And um, I thank you and I praise you. I bless your name. I give you the glory and the honor, Lord, that is due your name. 
Um, yes, Lord, you are due all glory, all honor, and all praise. You are worthy, Lord God Almighty. You are a worthy God. Um, you are the Lamb who was slain from before the foundation of the world. So, um, so this morning I I I look to you. I thank you, Lord, for your um, hand in my life, all the days of my life, from even before the time that I was born. Thank you um, for writing my name in the Lamb's Book of Life. I ask you, Lord, to keep my name in the Lamb's Book of Life. You have kept me, and I ask you to cover me in your blood, to cover me in the under the shadow of your wing. Um, I love you so much because you first loved me. I want to live 100% for you. I want my life to bring glory, honor, and praise to your name. So whether I have one day left or a hundred days left to live, my, my life is in your hands. My time is in your hands, dear Lord Jesus. And um, yes, so strengthen me, strengthen the listener in our inner being, in our inner spirit, and give us all that we need. Um, every day we ask for your daily provision whether it be in bread or fellowship or um, yeah physical bread or you know physical fellowship online fellowship all that we need lord you um, provide so um, jesus i love you jesus i love you jesus i love you for you first loved me um in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I pray. Amen. Thank you for listening and God bless you always. And um, yeah, until next time.